Potter. And I am trimming these poppy cones right now. Uh, this is how I trim them. They have a foot, they have a center area, they have three holes, and these ones have channels cut into them. And uh, the reason I'm going to show you what I'm doing is they're a great example of learning to trim a centered foot on something, on a pot that's not centered. So this is a great trick I learned in my pottery apprenticeship and just so awesome. So a coffee cone is not centered. You can see the Giffen grip is holding it, but it's touching my thumb and then not. So this thing is going around. And the way to trim a pot that's off center is to learn to ride your hand on it and then ride the tool along that hand. So instead of having my body be the center, I have trained myself to always have the pot itself be the center. So if I were to have myself be the center, then I would be trimming an off-center foot on this coffee cone. You can purposely make a pot be off center and trim it to practice if you want. These ones, the feet get so vulnerable that sometimes I can run my hand underneath just to make sure I don't put too much pressure on there. Okay. All right. I hope you can see that. three holes on these. I might just do it along the line of the shape of the cone, the football shape of the cone. So there you have it. A centered foot on a pot that was not centered on the wheel. Have fun in the studio.